What's going on guys? I've got here a 2012 Hyundai Santa Fe and I'm using this car to point out to you the location of the two or three fuses for the operation of your radio. Whether or not you have two or three fuses will depend on whether or not you have nav or an amplifier, which is tied to your level of trim. So we can access all of these fuses behind this cover here, which we remove by just pulling away at the bottom. So it will hinge out like so. You can read about the fuses here on the back, but I'll go ahead and show you what you need to know. And I'll also show you or tell you what the color coding is for each wire that goes to the head unit. So I'll begin with this 15 amp fuse here at the bottom. Power from this fuse is constantly sent to the head unit on a black, uh, or it's sorry, a black red wire. So this should be sending constant power. Now there's another fuse here, this 10 amp fuse. This only sends power to the head unit or the radio when the car is on. So that's like the ignition switch power and that's the battery power. Now some of you will also have a 30 amp fuse located here. The role of this fuse is to provide power to the amplifier, which is located underneath the passenger seat. And that power is constantly sent on a red black wire. So those are the three fuses for you to check. Um, I have found sometimes with these original factory radios, they can start to act weird and you can sometimes have luck by resetting them. Um, to do a radio reset, you'll want to remove all of the radio related fuses and leave them out for about five minutes and then reinstall them. That can sometimes get your radio to start working again. So yeah, I hope that this information was helpful for you or at the very least a good starting point in troubleshooting the radio on your Santa Fe, please do let me know down below if you have any questions or any advice.